Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. Today, find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, EMA, Divergence and Stochastic RSI show. If you are unfamiliar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos below. Looking at the IOTA hourly time frame, the price dipped down with around 3.4%, but then came quickly up again in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 23.4 cents. Moving to the hourly simple moving averages, the current price is between the 20 and the 50 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 23.2 cents it could be seen as a support and the 50 SMA that is at 23.8 cents could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Important to note is that the price is currently below the 200 SMA, which is can play as a strong resistance. However, breaking it decisively to the upside will signal a potential big move up. Moving to the hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is in the hourly ribbon, so it is to see if the price can break the resistance currently at around 23.7 cents. The resistance should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. Searching for divergence in the hourly time frame, there is a bullish divergence, which means the price could go up from now or at least consolidate for some time. Jumping to the hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but because the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, we can deduce that the trend is currently on the up. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, the price has crossed the 20 SMA downwards but it's not a very strong signal that the volume hasn't been very high. The current price is between the 100 and the 20 SMA. If the price bounces off the 100 SMA which is currently at 22.7 cents it could be seen as a support and the 20 SMA that is at 24.0 cents could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Jumping to the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price went below the three hourly ribbon, so you should wait to see if the price will jump back above the ribbon or it will act as a resistance to the upside which is at around 23.6 cents at the moment. Jumping to the three hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, which means the current trend is to the upside. Jumping to the daily simple moving averages, the price broke the 200 SMA to the downside but it's not a very strong signal that the volume hasn't been very high. The current price is between the 100 and the 200 SMA. If the price bounces off the 100 SMA which is currently at 22.1 cents it could be seen as a support and the 200 SMA that is at 24.8 cents could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Jumping to the daily exponential moving averages, the current price is above the daily ribbon, which is generally bullish and the ribbon could play as a support, so it is to watch if the price could bounce off it. The current price to watch is around 20.7 cents. However, the ribbon is compressed, which means the current trend is not very strong and a trend change could be expected. Jumping to the daily stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.